Hey, hello friends, my name is Sagar Joshi. Today I'm going to talk about axis modifiers. Axis modifiers defines the accessibility of members or you can say functions or methods. There are total five different types of access modifiers. The first one is public. Second is private. Protected. Fourth one is internal. And the fifth is protected internal. Public means it is accessible even outside the class. Private means it is accessible within the class. Protected means it is accessible within the derived classes. Internal means it is accessible within the assembly. And protected internal means it is accessible within the direct class and within the assembly. These are all the definitions of access modifiers. Let's have a look at real life examples of access modifiers. First, we'll take an example of WhatsApp. Everyone uses WhatsApp. Then there's an option in WhatsApp called as last seen. where everyone or few users can see your last scene. There are further two options in your settings. That is, you can either select everybody or you can select my contacts. If you select everybody, then everyone will be able to see your last scene. This can be called as an example of public modifiers. And if you select this option, my contacts, the people in your contact list will be able to see your last scene. No one else will be able to see your last scene. So the users are restricted. So this can be an example of protected. So let's take a second example of people living in your own house. This can be an example of private, private modifier. Only your family can stay in your house. No one else, no outsider can stay in your house. The third example we can take is using public restrooms or visiting public parks. This can be an example of public modifier. Everyone is able to access these two things. The fourth example we can take is of libraries. Libraries in school or college and public libraries. In public libraries, everyone is able to access this library. So this is an example of public. 
and over here only the students of that particular school or that particular college is able to access that library so this can be an example of protected so this is all about access modifiers thanks for watching this video